Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to check battery cycles on your iPhone. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, the first thing you're gonna do is hop into your settings here. And if you just scroll down and find battery above privacy and security and tap on that, and then tap on battery health and charging, you'll see the maximum capacity, but you won't see the cycle count. So if you wanted the exact cycle count, which is basically how many times your phone battery has drained down and then been recharged to 100%, you can find that just by hopping out of here and we're gonna open up a web browser. And you're gonna type in power util shortcut. So you can see this iTech everything, I'm gonna tap on it. And at the very top, we're gonna tap on add to shortcuts. This will automatically add this specific shortcut to your phone. So hit add shortcut. And I'm just gonna hit replace here because I already had it on there. So you can see I have this shortcut on here. It'll help me be able to find that cycle count. So now that I've done that, I'm gonna hop out of here and go back into my settings. And I'll go back and back again. And we're gonna tap on privacy and security here. We'll scroll down to the bottom and you'll be able to see analytics and improvements. Let's tap on that. And then at the very top, you can see analytics data. Now you need the share iPhone analytics toggled on so that it tra tracks and captures all that analytics data. But let's tap on analytics data. And we're gonna tap on the very first option that has analytics. So in this case, analytics 2023 12-7. So I'm gonna tap on it and you can see a bunch of information that doesn't make much sense. However, we're gonna use that shortcut. Just tap the share button at the top, right? And then we're gonna tap on power util right here. And I'm gonna hit always allow and you'll see it immediately pops up with the cycle count. So I have 176 cycles on this iPhone, average temperature, max battery capacity is 100%, and then the power util calculated battery health is 94.4%. And it says, this is a measure of your current battery capacity compared to the battery capacity that Apple lists on their website. So basically what you can do is get a bit more information and granularity about your specific battery and the battery health for your iPhone. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. And I'll catch you on the next one.